We have McKinsey night tonight and for Jen De La Cruz, these are the conditions that make firefighters nervous. Yes, the uh, hot and dry conditions. Thankfully, the one thing for us, the wind is not here, but it's on its way outside though, wherever you are. Solana Beach looking beautiful. Ramona also a beautiful night. We're also talking about a much cooler night than what we saw yesterday. As we take a look around the county, much uh, cooler than yesterday. Look at that cooling off 10 degrees in Kearney Mesa, eight in La Jolla, nine in Poway, Escondido, Ramona, even Alpine. And and this cooling trend going to continue tonight's lows. As we take a look, we will be dropping down to the low 60s, maybe mid 60s for our coast, upper 60s for our inland valleys and this cool down. Now well, that's going to bring us into the work week and bring us to about Friday. Strong winds will also pick up tomorrow and we are tracking some more fire danger ahead. This three day temperature trend is showing us that cool down as we are back in the upper 70s for Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday 75, so we'll be back to about normal. Inland valleys will actually be below average for this time of the year, dropping into the uh, mid 80s and then low 80s by Wednesday. Wind gusts, though, this is what I was talking about. We we are dealing with the hot and dry conditions. We'll lose the heat, but now we're getting the wind. So the fire danger not leaving just yet. Keep your eye on the mountains and the deserts. Monday night around 11 o'clock, we'll see anywhere between 30 and 40 mile per hour wind gusts in the mountains and the deserts. We could see an advisory, but so far nothing yet. Those will calm down by Tuesday afternoon. If we take a look at our relative humidity future cast around Tuesday early morning, right now it's looking okay. We are seeing some of these uh, low relative humidities, so that could be a factor that could cause some concern for firefighters. But by Tuesday, again, it's just those few hours overnight into Tuesday morning that will cause some concern for firefighters. 70 forecast showing us a little bit of overnight fog tonight and into tomorrow morning. 79 though overnight low is going to be low 60s fog returning again Wednesday and Thursday morning. So just be cautious on those morning commutes. Inland Valley is going to deal with the fog Tuesday and Friday, but back in those mid 80s again, like I mentioned below average for this time of the year. Tomorrow breezy conditions for both the mountain and the desert, but picking up to become windy on Tuesday. Mm, so a lot of interesting things happening here <laughs> yeah. coming together. It feels like it's like a juggle, right? right? All those three things. All right. Thanks, Mackenzie.